2012. Okay, so what is this? Like. So this is a biological neuron in animals that is used to store and retrieve information and even act as a calculator. And what I'll be doing is modeling a neuron in software. And it could be useful for um, hooked up to electronics. It could be useful as a database. Um, so first we'll go into this electronic project that I created here. And uh, I have two photo cells. I have um, an electronic programming where it's comparing the two. So I could set an alarm off if it compares the two to detect motion. It could average the two sensors to see the light level. If I had lenses on there, here um, I'm using it to test organic eggs and brown eggs for an experiment. Um, so I'll be loading up Visual Studio 2022. And uh, I have my neuron class. loaded up and uh, ready to test out in software and here we go okay um, this is the class neuron neurons are a biological cell and there's an input and an output in a neuron so the dendrite receives information, an input, and an axon is information that comes out of it in a biological neuron. So this class of neuron can be used in that way. So there's a, a size and, and an output, um, and there's methods for this class. So if you notice, the output is Boolean logic right here. So um, what happens is uh, uh, neural networks have an axon hillock that is the algebraic sum of the inputs, and then you get one output, a yes or no answer. Um, and then there's information stored in the neuron. So this class works in that same way. So if you build... Uh, a tree with this class it'll act like a neuron nervous system so let's build this um, and I'm gonna see if there's any errors and then I'm gonna run a code analysis oh that was short let's see test analyze Run code analysis. So we're going to run through all the files. So 
So I want to run this class with photo cells. And collect maybe colors. But I also have um, this class, money. So this is, um, I'm working in a Microsoft Visual, Visual Studio 2022. Here is my class, money. I'm going to build a tree with this, money tree. Uh, and then this is, this is Microsoft Visual Studio 2019. So you can't, I'm not authorized to create software yet with Visual Studio 2022. And um, if you go into this window here, you see all the H files and the C++ files. I could uh, actually add a class, money. Here we go. Um, this is a GUI I'm working on for the application that uses the neural network class in the binary search tree. Um, this thing is going to store and retrieve information in the neural network. Here we go. So let's uh, run this software without a user interface panel. So we'll create. We'll give a key there, red. Let's say it's a password. So if I'm using this as a password keeper, um, the key would be red. And so if I want to find the password, I enter the key and it gives me the password. So after upgrading from Windows 10 to Windows Update and from Visual Studio 2019 to Visual Studio 2022, I'm checking the weather charts and I'm going to go run out in the weather with a GoPro. These are webcams I've searched from Half Dome to Oceanside webcams and what I don't have is personal eyewitness accounting of the weather it's an atmospheric river running through North America right there look at that so I'm gonna put on a GoPro and capture the video next to the Transamerica Pyramid.
I have a body cam and uh, it's not that bad it doesn't seem that bad but here's a scenic view of the pyramid that we have and it's not that cold compared to other places